What is up Midway Mayhem fans? This is Dan and we are checking back into Fun Spot America, more specifically Kissimmee, for a mind blower construction update. And thankfully the weather gods have blessed us. It has stopped raining for a little bit so we can do this update. Structure still looks great. And of course we're over here at the stores lot where there is pretty much nothing left. We're still going to walk around and take a look at what's here. Well, this is good news. We had a whole bunch of steel pieces over here that was for the track work, and it is pretty much all gone. There's only one bundle left right here, and that's it. But everything else is on the site or on the course. A little further down the lot, we can still see a bunch of steel pieces here for the ride. And uh, I don't know about you guys, but it seems like the entire course is done so there's a lot of excess. I don't know, maybe there's just odds and ends left to put on, but there's still quite a bit here. One last look at the storage lot at what remains, and there is not much, but we are going to head over to the construction site now and see what's new with Mind Blower. Ah yes, there's Mind Blower looking great, and then over here we have a lift with some workers working on that 90 degree bank turn. There he is right there. They're probably tightening down all the bolts and everything. And again, through the mess of steel, we can see that track work. This is from our last update, but it looks like everything is cleaned up around the area. And it extends down this way, back towards the double down. More track work continues over here with a pair of workers that are putting the steel pieces right on the wood right now. So they have the clamps that holds everything together. And then in come the bolts. At the lift hill house, we have a gentleman inside, and there's power on. Looks like we're doing a little programming. The work continues, and hopefully we'll have that motor fired up real soon. Thankfully, it looks like there's a fan inside the lift hill motor house to keep things cool, but it's hot. From what I can tell, most of this structure has all the track work done, as we can see over here. The guide wheels and road wheels have that steel piece right there. No upstops just yet, but it does extend all the way back this way towards the double down. A little bit further down, we find a grouping of workers, again, doing all the track work here. So where it gets low to the ground, we're putting steel on right now. A little bit closer view now of the track work on the double down here and where it leads down and banks really really well. We can see through the supports that has steel on it now as well. So leading around then we have the overbank up there and just beyond over here there's something special inside the maintenance barn. Let's show you that. And what is this that I see? A mind blower train! Woohoo! This was delivered last week. And this is the red train. We have a black one that will be showing up probably in the next week or so. Fun Spot said June 14th, June 15th. We'll see if it shows up a little bit earlier, but there it is, folks, our first train.
And here's the lead car with the dynamite on the front of the train. And those wheel assemblies look really awesome as well. Very shiny. And of course you knew we were gonna check up on this crazy 115 degree bank turn. It looks absolutely amazing. And they are about to put in the last piece of steel right there on top. But crews are lining this entire section, putting in the final bolts right now. And just like that, another piece of steel is going on to complete the overbank turn. Barrel roll structure looks really good, and they have all the wood in place. And we are starting to put on some of that steel for the track, as those guys right there are doing the lead out right now. Still lots and lots of steel left to bend. And that's what these guys are doing right now. Another view of the remaining steel left to bend before it heads on to the construction site for the roller coaster. So we have moved inside the park now and we're getting an awesome view of Mind Blower and the station work. And speaking of station work, check this out over here. We have an extension off the main building and we believe this is gonna be for the queue. We also have some gentlemen over here working on stairs leading up to it as well. And this whole area is blocked off right now. So unfortunately, we're not gonna be able to get much closer, at least on this side. But a lot of workers on here and a lot of progress. Another little tiny thing to note, the coverings right here for the pathway are back on. So from this side, we can see the two sets of stairs, the one right here that the crews are working on, leading up into the station. And then we have the other set right over here, as we zoom in, it's right there. So both sets now leading in to that station. and I see you're still sitting a little bit dormant, but that's all right. Eventually we'll get you open, but I think Mind Blower right now is the focus and you're kind of put off to the side. It's 
Screaming Eagles and no bumper, no. We have food dishing all over here, but just no side of the bumper. And I know Lauren is really upset about that because she came all the way out here just for bumper, not even for mind blower. New for 2017, the creature from the Fun Spot Lagoon rises. Well guys, that is going to do it for another Fun Spot America Mind Blower Construction Update. And I got to say, the Gravity Group is really outdoing themselves with this project. It looks absolutely fantastic. Cannot wait for the opening and I cannot wait for testing, which hopefully should be in the next two weeks. We do have another train that is going to be showing up very soon as well. We'll let you know when that happens. And crews are getting very close to completing the course. We're going to have more updates from here, so if you like what we do, follow us on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter at Midway Mayhem. And I will see you out on the Midway.